Here's Larry still leading this pack of cars. I just wonder if there has been a decision made, Neil. I know Larry's going to come in fairly, so uh, fairly shortly. Do they just stay behind? Hey guys, welcome to another Heavy Metal Diecast video. And today we have one here from the 2003 Bob Jane T-Mart 1000. It is the car that uh, Larry Perkins and Stephen Richards did race. It is the 2003 Perkins Engineering Castrol VY Commodore. Um, as I said, Larry Perkins and Stephen Richards did race this in the 2003 great race. After qualifying strongly, the number 11 car would make it to the top 10 shootout. And uh, unfortunately, uh, Larry Perkins actually crashed the car in practice prior to the uh, number 11's ability to be able to go in the shootout and compete and would actually start the 2003 race from 10th position. Uh, it would ultimately be won by Greg Murphy and Rick Kelly in the number 51 HSV VY Commodore, but Larry Perkins and Stephen Richards would finish the race fourth, and uh, that is a very commendable effort, and they just missed out on a podium, unfortunately. And we will look at this this beautiful rendition here this is a, a lovely looking car and uh we'll start we'll go straight underneath and as always these are 118th scale this is another great rendition from classic collectibles we'll have a real good look at the detail underneath there look at that that is great that there is a, a ton of detail underneath it. all the wiring the exhaust piping everything like that it is another great rendition. The, the wheels date, they do move. It does have that manipulation and they do roll and turn. They have a, a really nice rubber feel to them too. Uh, these ones are very nice indeed. The livery itself is quite well applied. It does look fantastic. You can see all the sponsorship on there, the window net, everything like that. We'll jump straight in the driver's door and have a little look for you. We'll open that up. Try and have a real good look inside there. There's some great detail in there. It is fantastic. All four doors do open. I will take photos of that so you can get a real good look at that. And I think this is another really cool one inch scale V8 supercar. This is fantastic. The, the color combination, it really stands out. We'll lift that bonnet and have a little look underneath. Yeah, this one does stay upright and perfect because it does have some detail that you can actually see on these engines. That, look at those leads. It is fantastic. Yeah, there is tons of detail in there. For sure, you'll be happy. If you can get your hands on one of these, these look pretty cool. And as usual, these are probably no longer available new. So you may have to source the secondhand market to actually find find these to purchase and get your, get your hands on one if you want one of these for your collection. We'll go around this side. We'll have a real close look on the passenger side here. Look at that. That is really nice. The details, excellent. The quality of these builds are quite good. We'll go straight through here. We'll have a look in the boot and see what we can find in here. And this one, this one has got some, oh, a massive amount of detail in here. Look at that. There is a ton of detail in there. That is just amazing. You will not be disappointed if you can get your hands on one of these. This is a really cool looking one. This this VY Commodore here. The uh, the rendition of this vehicle, I reckon it's fantastic. No, hopefully you will be in agreement with that. And I reckon this is another pretty cool looking unit for sure. I'll plonk this on the deck. And uh, look, if you can get your hands on one, I would grab one of these. These these are really tidy. I, I reckon it's a pretty cool looking one. So once again, this is the uh, Perkins Engineering Castrol VY VY Commodore, as raced at the 2003 Bob Jane Team Up 1000, and driven by Larry Perkins and Stephen Richards. So what I'll do is I'll take some happy snaps of this uh, VY Commodore, and you can check it out without my sausage fingers being in the way, and get some get a real good look at the detailed photos that I'll take of this. And as per usual, if you did find a little bit of enjoyment or use out of this video, take a couple of seconds, throw us a little like, that'd be awesome. And if you have yet to subscribe to the channel and you are enjoying these little videos we're putting out, the Bathurst editions, and plus my other content, feel free to subscribe, that would be awesome. All right, guys, thank you so much once again for spending your valuable time watching another one of my videos. I do appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day. Cheers, guys. Yeah.
Look at this attack by Jim oh, Richards. Jimmy goes up against his son, Stephen. This oh. is full position and they get together on wow. turn one. That kind of answers that question. I don't think there's any love lost there. <laughs>